Hello friends, I'm Dr. Sonika Trishin and today I'll be talking on the subject of Hast Mudras, the Mudra Therapy. These are the various hand alignment positions that are highly beneficial for the health and for the uh, staying clear of so many maladies. These are very simple uh, hand positions and uh, ha that have been specified in our Indian Vedic science, specifically the naturopathy. Because uh, it is believed that your health is in your hands. It is such a beautiful science in itself. See, this is the hand. And we are all made up of five basic elements as the universe is made up of all the five elements. Now, the thumb and the four fingers, they represent the same elements. The thumb, this represents Agni or the fire. The index finger, this represents Vayu or the air. The middle finger, this represents Akasha, that is the ether or sky. The ring finger, this represents earth or the prithvi. And this little finger is Jala or water at basic element. So these are the five elements. Now any problem that emerges is basically because whenever we lose the balance. These five elements, they need to be balanced within our body so that we can enjoy the fruit of health. But problem emerges when either they are increased or decreased and their normal uh, limits. So these hand alignments or the mudras that I will be just sharing with you, they will tell you that how you can bring the, the five elements back to balance and be healthy and be in the state of wellness. Now this is Dhyan Mudra. Very easy to make this mudra. All you need to do is touch the tip of your index finger with the tip of your thumb. That is all. And keep the other three fingers straight. It's very easy to make. And this is a wonderful mudra for enhancing your memory powers, increasing your concentration, and reducing the mental stress. Whenever you are in the mental state of anger, frustration or irritation, practice this mudra. This is going to give you mental calm. And this is wonderful for the students and children when they are studying. They need to practice the mudra. This is the first mudra or the Gyan. Now Dhyana mudra. This is very easy to make. All you need to do is, on your left hand, Keep your right hand straight and keep them in your lap. Now, this is the Dhyana Mudra because this is the mudra that is highly beneficial when you sit in meditation. Keep it in your lap. And uh, this has a cooling and soothing effect on your mind. So, it is a stress buster in itself. When you're feeling stress, when there is anxiety, loss of sleep, insomnia, all these uh, problems can be relieved by practicing this mudra. This is the, the Shunya mudra. Shunya mudra, all you need to do is balance the akasha or the sky or ether. Now sky or ether is your middle finger. All you need to do is hold the middle finger, keep it in the root of the thumb, keep the thumb over it and press it slightly. Keep the other three fingers straight. This is wonderful for balancing sky or the ether and it helps to reduce the problems in the ear, specifically the pain in the ears. When we feel pain in the ears, try this mudra. This is the Surya Mudra. For making the Surya Mudra, all you need to do is fold your ring finger Keep it in the root of the thumb, keep the thumb over it and slightly press it. Keep the other three fingers straight up. Now this is the Surya Mudra. This is highly beneficial if you have to lose weight in case of weight loss, for obesity, for the problems of 
you're facing high cholesterol or heaviness in your body, all you need to do is practice this easy mudra. This is the this is Varun Mudra or the Jala Mudra. Jal or water is your little finger. Touch the tip of your little finger with the tip of your thumb. Keep the other three fingers straight. This is great in case of dry skin problems, in case of dehydration and this also acts as a natural blood purifier and is helpful in a number of skin ailments. All you need to do is practice this easy mudra called as the Varun Mudra. Prithvi Mudra. This is very easy to make. All you need to do is touch the tip of your ring finger with the tip of your thumb. Keep the other three fingers straight up. This is the mudra that is going to help you to gain weight. So highly beneficial for the people who are emigrated, who are weak and who want to gain some pounds of weight. All you need to practice is this easy mudra that is Linga Mudra. This is easy to make. All you need to do is clasp both the hands, tie the fingers together and keep the thumb of your left hand straight up. This is highly beneficial for respiratory ailments. When you have more of mucus in your system or more of phlegm in your system, it helps to remove the phlegm. This is recommended in case of common cold, sore throat and in case of asthma and other respiratory ailments. This practice is well. Now this is Vayu Mudra. Vayu is the index finger. All you need to do is hold your index finger Keep it in the root of the thumb and slightly keep the thumb over it with a, giving it a slight pressure. Keep the other three fingers straight. This makes the Vayu Mudra, this balances the Vayu. Whenever there is aggravation in the body of Vata Dosha or the Vayu or the air, this causes pain. So whenever you have to relieve pain, be it because of the joint pain, the muscular pains, or stomach pain, any kind of a pain, all you need to do is practice this easy mudra called as Vayu Mudra and then you can find relief. This balances the Vayu in your system and this is also called as pain. Apana Mudra or the Apana Vayu Mudra, very easy to make. All you need to do is touch the tips of your ring finger and middle finger with the tip of your thumb. Keep the other two fingers straight up. Now this is recommended for decreasing the gas prop in your abdomen. When there is more of wind formation, when you're with, there is bloaters or the gas problems, please practice this mudra. This is very easy to make. Practice it every day. This is the Apana Vayu Mudra or the Apana Mudra which releases the wind. The Prana Mudra, all you need to do is touch the tips of your little finger and ring finger to the tip of your thumb. Keep it steady, keep the other two fingers straight. Now this is, this is the Prana Mudra, Prana is your energy. So this mudra needs to be practiced for increasing the immunity levels or energy in your system. This is highly beneficial for adding natural glow to your skin. All you need to do is to increase the prana or the life force energy in your system. Just practice this mudra every day. This is the prana. Hridya mudra. This is a very important mudra specifically for the heart patients. All you need to do is fold your index finger, keep it steady in the root of the thumb. Keep the thumb over it and to the tip of the thumb, touch the tips of two of your fingers, that is the middle finger and the ring finger and keep your little finger straight. So this is how this mudra is made. This is the heart mudra. This is highly recommended in case of heart disease. In case you are suffering from the problem of heart palpitations, 
or high blood pressure or low blood pressure, any kinds of heart disease, you should practice this mudra every day. This is going to save you and this is going to help you. So this is the heart mudra specifically recommended for the heart. So thank you friends. Practice these mudras I just told you about. This is a wonderful science that helps us to balance the Panch Mahabhutas, the five basic elements, which can be causing problem in our natural uh, state of health and wellness. So you can visit me at my website, that is www.drsonikakrishnan.com and you can write me an email at sonikakrishnan at gmail.com. Thank you very much. We'll meet again soon.